Hey champs, welcome back for the new MLC Snoop Dogg Summer Jam. Yes, the top dog returns to host and kick off WWE Champions biggest event of the summer. The countdown to WWE SummerSlam is on. So I have my first five star silver character preview of the month the new mlc john morrison johnny drip drip let's take a look at his poster so he's a coach modern era acrobat so at 9k yellow moves starting mp reduced by two for your opponents and at 15k reduced by three links we have the raw link, any color moves starts with one more move point and the modern era jams do 5% more damage. Gears only one set of gear. So let's take a look at the first build. So we have the finisher, the starship pain, deals 89,957 damage and gains 6 purple MP. We have the European Uppercut, deals 30,542 damage and chooses a 4x1 area to make it to Snowfall Gems, which will modify all gems below it into blue gems when broken by you, and the Standing Moonsault, deals 15,109 damage and destroys row number 1. Basically, the European Uppercut and the Standing Wound Salt should be done together, if possible. So let's take a look at the Entourage. We have the Purple MP Trainer Xavier Woods. We have Christian Acrobat. Blue Gems do 25% more damage. I'm pretty sure it goes uh, to 35% at 5k. Uh, coaches, we have Afa. Blue Gems do 15% more damage. And Tazawa, Acrobat only reduces opponent's submission turns by 2. So I'm using Tazawa here. Just to reduce the Fiend's submission turns. Let's see if we can survive against a overpowered 2 million plus health points. All strapped. Fiend. Where those protect gems are coming already. At least I don't see any purple match the Fiend. Let's go ahead now with the European Uppercut and the Moonsault. Let's get rid of all those Protect Gems, or most of them. Moonsault, this will destroy the first row. Four oh three reduced to three hundred K. Of course, he kicks out. Our finisher is ready. Let's use it. This will load both purple moves. Now we have the submission and the bleed. From the fiend. Five turns.
No purple match. More protect gems on the board. Pink, more student strength to survive it. Same cycle, European uppercut and the moonsault. Four seventy three reduced to three forty four. I'm not using my, uh, I'm not going to use my finisher here. more bleed go one more time same cycle we put the fiend can we put the fiend down Twenty-two reduced to three hundred eight. Nope. The fiend started at two point one three million health points. He's down to eight forty-seven k. It's pretty good already. Of course, it's black. Again, loaded. I'm going again with the same cycle here. Let's see if I can put him down now. Let's get rid of all those tech gems. Moonsault. Is it enough? To pee, to pin the showboat fiend. Nice little cascade there. 476 reduced to 407. No way he's gonna kick out. And he didn't! So let's take a look at a second build for a Johnny Drip Drip. So we have the Super Kick, it deals 3092 damage and makes 4 random gems into multiplied gems of strength 5. That's a 1 MP charge. We have the Springboard Roundhouse, it deals 3824 damage plus 16246 bonus damage for every multiplied gems. So that's also a 1 MP charge. And the spear deals 6731 damage and chooses a 2x2 two two area to destroy. That's a 2 MP charge. Entourage for that build. I'm not using any MP trainer. Oh, Sin Kara. Moves that generates multiply gems will create 3 more multiply gems. Uh, I have him only at 3k. At 5k, I think it's 4. Uh, Matt Hardy Showboat. Multiply gems generated from moves will increase their strength by 2. Coaches, we have Afa, blue gems do 15% more damage, and Tazawa reduces opponent submission by two turns, only at uh, 7k, at 9k I think it's three turns. We're going against the Fiend again, let's do this, super kick. Springboard, roundhouse. Let's 
let's load. Create some damage here without destroying any of those multiply gems. Of course, he gets a purple match. Super kick. Let's, let's try to hit one. Blue and one green. We can. Fortunately, we can, so I'm gonna hit only that blue here. Damage. The bleed is coming. He's almost down of 1 million health points already. It's pretty good. Of course he... Of course, he gets Cascades. Submission is ready next turn. Again, same cycle, super kick first. Inboard Roundhouse. Where's the spear? <clears throat> Is it off here? And the submission also for five turns. Again, facing five star silvers strapped, so different from facing four star, uh, five star bronze. Try to finish him now. Maybe next turn. I need to. His bleed is still like wow. down to 663,000 health. Let's try to finish him now. All of those multiplied gems on the board. Oh, yeah, he's done. He's done. And to finish the fiend.
We lost a lot of health again due to bleed and submission. So let's take a look at a third build I have. I still have the super kick and the springboard roundhouse. But now I'm replacing the 5 star bronze spear move with the multiple four arms. Deals 29,429 damage and chooses four gems to make it to blue gems. Entourage. I still have Sin Kara and now I have my green MP trainer George the Animal Steel. Same coaches. Afa, blue gems to 15% more damage. And Tazawa. He reduces submission turns by two. We can't forget also that we're going in with no perks, not strapped, so basically it's raw damage versus you guys know the rest. Okay, let's start with a super kick again. And the springboard round house. I don't have a green match. And same cycle. Both of them are one MP charge. Again, no green match. I'm gonna take his black here. Bleed is ready. Again, same cycle super kick. Springboard, roundhouse. Okay. Choose four gems to make it to blue gems. Unfortunately, I didn't hit any greens. Submission is ready for um, the fiend next turn. And unfortunately, with that bleed, I'm getting ton of, tons of damage. I'll take away his purple here. Try to finish him. Do I have enough? Do I have enough multiply gems on the board to finish him right now? Hmm.
Not quite. He's gonna put his protect gems, but he's done next turn. But again, I lost a lot of health points. I'm not facing an easy opponent, that's for sure. But that combo, bleed, sub, the fiend, over 2.2 million health points. Pretty sick. All over for the fiend. One, two, three. So the chase character of this month, Snoop Dogg's Summer Jam. MLC is Mr. Monday Night Delight, John Morrison. So that's it, champs, for this character preview of John Morrison, Monday Night Delight, the chase character of this month's Snoop Dogg Summer Jam. The countdown to WWE SummerSlam is on. If you enjoy, please give a like. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do. Until next time. Benny's out.